Okay, Paul, can you give us a little history on the evolution of eccentric disc pumps at Mubex? Yes. So, well, the story started with the uh, forerunner of the uh, A-series. This is interesting. This is the first uh, sealless eccentric disc pump. It is called the S-series. Uh, launched in 1969, still in production today. Uh, one of the features of this pump is it's not only the eccentric disc, not only the sealless design, it's also a pump which is extremely easy to take apart. If you look how it's made, you just open that big clamp, put off the cover, take out that big washer, pull off the disc and the cylinder. So you see how easy, how easy mm -hmm. and quick it is. You can see that I've used absolutely no tools. Among, if we and this is an actual product, this is not a demo. This is this a is real the, pump. You can put thing. that on, a, you can take that pump with you, put that on an installation, it works, it pumps, it transfers, right? It's not, it's not, just, a, not just a demo tie. So you can see this is a CLS pump. Very first generation with that rubber bellows here. Mm -hmm. And among the markets using this pump, we can mention cosmetic industry because they don't do cleaning in place most of the time, they are doing hand cleanings. And they love the pump because this pump can be taken apart several times a day if needed, quickly hand cleaned and put back together very, very quickly. Why would it need to be taken apart several times? To be cleaned. Okay. To be cleaned, I mean, yeah, okay. the cosmetic industry, if they are transferring ointments or mm -hmm. you know, creams or gels, so between two batches they want to clean the pump. And as they don't do cleaning in place, they do manual cleaning in these industries. So they just open the pump, clean every part. Some of them are even putting this in kind of dishwashers and they put it back together and start again. So they love the pump because it's very, very easy and quick to do. So they really love the pump for this. 